This is Pawnee Prepper Bill. Today is August 7th, 2021. And in this video, I'm going to go complete conspiracy crazy shit on you. The last two years, or year and a half, unless you've lived under a rock, we are living a com completely weird life than what we're used to. And it's like, like I said in other videos, every bad, cheesy sci-fi movie we've ever watched from the 60s, 70s, what the hell was that? From the 60s, 70s, 80s, we're living it. You know, it's almost like the zombie apocalypse and the lockdowns. And, and speaking of lockdowns, Governor Murphy in New Jersey just put the mandate back in for the masks everywhere you go. Well, Wawa, you need a mask. CVS, you need a mask. Uh, we went to two places to eat, or my wife did today, and everybody's jammed in there and not wearing a mask. But And while, while they got one door closed, it, it's right back to stupidity. You know, you had two doors, you could have one way in, one way out. No, got to wear a mask, and everybody's funneling in through the same entrance. Just pure stupidity. But anyway, when have you ever gotten anything for free? An upgrade. You know, when the plasma TVs came out, you couldn't take your old 13-inch TV and trade it in and get a free TV. When uh, the Bluetooth came out, you couldn't trade your truck radio in and get a free upgrade. You had to pay for it. It's technology. You got to pay for it. Last year, when this lockdown happened, my wife was an essential employee, and I took her to work once or twice. Nobody on the roads. No, there was no traffic. Everywhere where it's bumper to bumper, we were the only car. Maybe one or two other ones. It was unbelievable. But everywhere you looked was Comcast, Verizon, everywhere. They're putting the new wires in for the, the new 5G. Uh, I watched these commercials. We're watching TV and commercial comes up. And for AT&T or Sprint or whatever it was, doesn't matter. You can turn in your phone. It doesn't matter if it's broken, if it works, if it's cracked, out of date. Turn it in and you will get a thousand dollars off a new 5G phone. Here comes the bike. They were giving away free phones. They're giving away free phones with the 5G. And another one, if you signed up, you got a 5G phone for free. I got a text from my phone. I forget who we have, singular, cellular or something. And pretty soon I have to upgrade to the 5G or my phone is going to be obsolete. It won't work. That's fine. When that comes, I won't have a cell phone. I don't need it. I don't really take it with me anyway, just in case I break down. And even then it goes in a toolbox in the back of the truck. I don't keep it with me. I don't use my phone. So they're ramping up to 5G. Whether you think that's a good thing or not, it doesn't matter at this point. They're giving free phones out. The government is pretty much mandating now that you take uh, a cure for uh, a virus. And some places they have lotteries where you can win a truck, a brand new pickup truck, you can win a million dollars, five hundred thousand dollars, sign up bonuses if you take this cure. They're giving it away for free. Everywhere you go, everybody will give it to you for free. And if you don't take it, there's incentives to get it. And that's kind of strange to me, you know, if they're pushing you to get something you don't want, and they're forced, like, giving you money, like uh, taking a carrot in front of a donkey, here, 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 here. But that's beside the point. Here's where the conspiracy theory comes in. And this is just me. This is my conspiracy mind. I think it's the 11th, August 11th. They're going to do a wireless emergency broadcast to your cell phone. Everybody... I think, I didn't see the videos, I didn't read the whole thing, but people have been talking about this. And it's going to be an emergency alert, a wireless, a new thing, 
And what got me thinking is, since we're living all these different movies, or like we're living these movies, all these two years jammed together, has anybody seen the movie Cell? It came out in 2016 with John Cusack, where something happens and there's a signal in the phone and everybody goes crazy. What if, okay, now, what if there's something in the, the cure that people are getting? Nanobots, people are talking, there's nanobots in it, there's nanotechnology, and there's whatever. What if on the 11th, I don't know what time it happens, just say it's noon, if there's a signal, the new 5G test signal comes to these phones, everybody's phones, and what if there's something in your body now that makes you go crazy, or you could die, epilepsy, you could, heart attack, whatever, or you become a zombie. Or maybe it's not them. <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe it's the people that aren't vaccinated. Maybe all the stuff we've been breathing in from the chemtrails is making us sick. And maybe the people that are vaccinated are healthy now and we're the ones who go crazy. Did you ever see that movie? Like this? stage in human evolution. What's happening now is more than temporary anarchy. So, that's my conspiracy mind. This is just something I'm throwing there out there to you. This is Pawnee Prepper Bill, and on the 11th, I think I'm going to stay home, put my phone outside, and I might not leave my house. I'm going to avoid crowds in stores. I'm going to hunker down in my house, and I'm not going to turn the TV on until the 12th and see the news and see what's happening. This is Pony Prepper Bill, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.